Continuing in my ultralight series, I want to go over the new Tokes Titanium Light 650 milliliter uh, pot. And also the BRS stove. And kind of show you what I've got going on here. So the new Tokes Titanium, I think, is probably one of the lightest um, pots that I've ever found. Uh, with the lid, it weighs 80 grams. Uh, it does have a nice stuff sack that weighs uh, an additional. It's pretty light. Weighs 12 grams for the stuff sack. 81 grams. I don't know why that's coming up different. Probably due to the weather. Um, then the stove is 25 grams. And with its stuff sack, 27 grams. Um, I'm actually using a spoon out of the GSI Minimalist. Um, I kind of like the way that this works. The other thing is too, when everything is in the stuff sack, this fits inside. Um, it weighs 8 grams for the spoon. Now if I wanted to go lighter, I can use just a generic plastic plastic spoon it weighs five grams the problem is it doesn't fit inside the stuff sack without it sticking out the top so the other thing I've got is a mini Bic lighter this is brand new it's only been lit a few times so they weigh 10 grams and there are a couple of other things that I keep in my cook pot um, I've reviewed it and other items. I keep a small scouring pad and also a small uh, quarter of a camp towel and that makes up my cook kit. Uh, the reason why I don't have them displayed on the screen is because I used them recently and haven't washed them and they look pretty nasty. But uh, let me put everything back. So this is the smaller uh, 110 gram isobutane cans. It does fit inside the tokes. Then I keep the stove in the stuff sack just because it does make it easier to see. So it gets fits in there. Then the lighter fits in there. Then I put my towel and Brillo pad in, the lid goes on, the stove goes in the stuff sack, then I put the spoon down the side. And with everything just like that, total weight is 364 grams 12.8 uh, ounces if you weigh it without the can without the stove or without the fuel I'm sorry So now we're back to everything without the fuel. It weighs 5.2 ounces, 149, 148 grams. So I think this is probably one of the lightest cook sets that I've seen unless you're using biomass. Um, I do have a uh, stove. Uh, with biomass, it is actually lighter 
if you include the weight of the fuel. Um, bio, the thing about biomass versus isobutane, I've covered this before, is biomass takes about 20 minutes before you can even think about putting your cook pot on there. So if you've got time at camp to use biomass, that's the lightest way to go. Um, if you're in a hurry though, isobutane works great. Another option would be the Esbit tablets, which the nice thing about Esbit is um, every for every day you're on the trail, your pack weight actually gets lighter because that's a consumable, the Esbit tablets are. This one, even when you run out of all the fuel, you're still going to have the weight of the canister, which is about, um, I have it here, about four ounces. Uh, no, I'm sorry, three and a half ounces for the canister. Um, so... Lots of options for going ultra light with cook sets, but this is my favorite if I'm in a hurry. If I'm only going for like two or three days, I usually use the uh, biomass method, but for long hikes, I do isobutane. So, hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share.